Hello, please mind the mess. Um, I'm about to fully flip my bedroom, and uh, in the meantime, you get this and this. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Lisa Schwartz. I'm happy to have you here and um, back for another Cup She haul try on video. Uh, if you guys didn't know, I have been partnering with Cup She for the last couple of months to present to you their latest and greatest in terms of not only uh, bathing suits they do do that I feel like they're like pretty like well known or at least that's how I came to know them through their bathing suits but they also do loungewear and workout wear and they've really just expanded um, their clothing line and um, truthfully and honestly I really enjoy it I feel like their price points are totally reachable and accessible and their quality is wonderful and you can keep up with trends without you know feeling bad that you're spending tons of money on things and or that you are getting poor quality this is like the best of all worlds in my opinion so I am really happy to team up with them I will say however this round of clothing that just arrived to my house um, came in a very small bag and that leads me to believe that the majority of things in here are bathing suits and am I prepared to try on bathing suits right now no <laughs> this is not the season however it is randomly very hot here in LA so I guess tis is the season tis the tis the season tis the I'm gonna try on baby suits <laughs> before they do that I did get a couple of notes from Cupshe that I wanted to share with you because I thought that they were interesting um like I mentioned before they um are now doing loungewear and dresses and I'll leave the links to all the uh, previous videos I've done for Cup She, so you can see uh, some of the dresses that I tried on that I have in my closet and wear frequently. Um, and oh yeah, I, I mentioned this before, but another thing that I really like about them is that they're pretty size inclusive. They have sizes ranging from extra small to 4X. And what I love, of course, is that they are offering this Black Friday sale. I'll leave the link and the code below. Lastly, um, they seemed pretty adamant about me sharing this, and I'm happy for that. They've made some changes. Apparently, they have listened to the comments. They're pretty active in terms of listening to their audience and replying back. And this is what they said they have improved, and we will try this on and decide for ourselves if in fact they have improved these um what they have improved the cup is easier to remove than before which i think is awesome i usually remove the cups from my bikini tops because they slide around but i did find them difficult to get out so that's nice uh they have new sliders and rings or strapping that was um that is now more adjustable which is nice they deliver consistent products with standardized rides and bum coverage so customers know exactly wet they're purchasing which is nice because I feel like sometimes in pictures it looks different on the model and you get it and you're like my whole butt is hanging out um so that's nice and hopefully my whole butt will not be hanging out today um uh and we improved cup quality and we'll make the cup shape more individually tailored for each style um and they offer better print quality and trim work so cool like I said before I typically will pick out the items to try on but I did not do that this time they just sent me a whole thing so I'm just gonna jump right into it and uh see what we have let's do this this is fun okay I just want to let you know that I just like unpacked everything and everything looks so cute it's actually kind of fun that I didn't pick out my own stuff because I feel like they did a good job that being said there's so many bathing suits and I it's I uh, I didn't shake my legs you know what I mean I just didn't uh, all right like, this one's for you. Give this video a thumbs up. Let's do this. All right, November bikinis. Not mad about you. I'll tell you that. I This is the first one I pulled out that I really, really was excited to try on. I love just a traditional hot pink bikini and the scallop is everything. Let me show it to you and then uh, I'll give you the description. Here she is. Pretty cute. Come on. We love a hot pink bikini. I just feel like no matter what, it just like brightens up your whole look and it's just fun and funky and very California girl. Very, very cute. This is the Amelie Scalloped Halter Triangle Bikini. The whole thing was $24.99, which I love. It comes as a set. Um, this is a high-waisted, which I actually 
don't love a high-waisted. I like a high-waisted pant, but in a bathing suit, I think my body proportions, I actually look better with a smaller bottom. But these fit really nicely. Um, I love the scallop on top. I just like a scallop print in general, but I like it on top. I find it to be very flattering. And also, like, this isn't a small. I'm traditionally a small, but their um, stuff isn't, like, super, like, um, tight. So it lays nicely so that, you know, you don't feel like you're like constricted and like popping out in places you don't want to pop out. So I think this is really nice. And again, for the price point, like, come on. Um, the quality is really cute. I don't know. I don't have much to say. I do like a triangle top. And I did notice that I guess we can try to take out the pads, but I like the way that they're placed right now. They're pretty thin in this one. So yeah, this is just a great, um go to bikini and what I like about all their stuff is that obviously it's very interchangeable and their color schemes kind of go together um, so I could definitely pair this with a different bottom either from this new collection or from one of the other old collections that I have so I think we're off to a pretty good start and I would say like there's no point in me trying on bathing suits right now but literally it is 90 degrees out so yeah I might have a pool party Thanksgiving situation to go to so uh, here we are this is the perfect one for it uh, okay, hi, I'm in a bathing suit. Let's keep going. Okay, if I'm being 100% serious, I think this bathing suit might be a little too sexy to show on camera, and it's a one piece, but I'm gonna do it anyways because that's the kind of committed gal I am, but um, I feel that this is very revealing. For some reason, I find this to be very revealing. Is this too revealing? Um, Maybe it's like the underboob situation. I think it's very sexy. I just am like, whoa, okay, we're doing this on camera. Um, but I'll do a quick little turn. I might not show my tushy, um, but I like the crisscross of this. This is beyond. I probably could have sized up actually on this one, um, but let me just read this to you. This is the Michaela striped cutout one piece swimsuit, $27.99. Um, and again, I got it in a small, but I would maybe size up a little bit because I feel like it's just with the crisscross, it's a little tight. Um, but here it is. I do think this is very cute and very sexy, like I said. Um, uh, I, why is it so interesting? Why does it feel like the other one's obviously like more revealing, the two piece, like you can see my whole stomach, but there's something like very like, I don't know about this. I guess because like when you're in the two piece, you're like, all right, here I am in the two piece. But this is almost like I'm just showing bits and pieces and there's something like kind of naughty about that. I like it though. And I love this pattern and this print. It's pretty cute. I don't know. The pad, I have noticed in the pads and these are thinner than usual and I like that a lot. Uh, just personally speaking, I don't like a lot of extra padding, but you know, it might depend on the size too, just as how much and how big they are. But again, those are removable. Um, yeah, here she is. This is pretty fierce. I don't know if my belly button is supposed to be showing, like if I should pull that down. I think this is just how it goes. Okay, I'm going to change out of this one. I feel scandalous. But uh, yeah, I guess if you need a sexy scandalous bathing suit, this is the one for you. Okay. Ding, ding, ding. I think I might have found my new favorite bathing suit, uh, at least so far in this collection. I feel really comfortable. That was confident and comfortable, mushed together, comfortable uh, in this. And I love the pattern. And this makes me feel like I should go surfing. I don't surf, but I should go do some water sports on vacation somewhere on a tropical island. So here it is. I just definitely feel like a surfer girl. Like I like this. I think it's really fun. I like um, the size and shape of the bottom and definitely the top I feel supported in. It feels like a sports bra. That's kind of my comfort zone in terms of undergarments. So I love this pattern. Also, they have done um, updates on the clamps and stuff because this is a really good backing. I really, really, really like this. It feels secure. It's easy to do. 
all about it. Let me um, read about this. Yeah. All right. This is the Greasy Leafy Scoop Neck Tank Bikini. Oh, that's why, because it's like a tank top. I like this a lot. And it's $32.99, which is a little more expensive than the others, but that's for the whole, like the top and bottom. I got mine in a small, um, but I actually think that pricing for something like this is great because this, at least to me, this is one of those bathing suits that I'll get a lot of use out of and I could use for different things. Like, not like we're going on vacation anytime soon, but when we do, we always go on like a water hike or some sort of like sporting type thing. And I feel like this is like the perfect thing to wear for that. I am just babbling. I am clearly very excited about this one. Um, so one more look. The bottoms, I'm trying to decide if I like to like hike them up a little bit or hiking down. I have a little, like, I'm not super comfortable with this region. Listen, everybody, everybody and everybody um, has different feelings about things. So you might say like, Lisa, you're insane. That's, you look great. Or Lisa, you're insane. Why are you in a bikini on camera? You look horrifying. Um, so, you know, bear with me when I give reviews of things um, in terms of my body. Like, this is just my personal opinion, how I feel. I'm not super comfortable with like this region of my legs. So I usually like to pull down my bathing suits, but then sometimes that compromises up here. So, you know, I think it's just a matter of playing around and figuring out where I like want to sort of lay the, bu the bikini or lay the fabric on my bod. But Overall, I think this is awesome. I'm really into this. And again, I feel totally comfortable. I could like, you know, spend a whole day in this and uh, feel supported and feel cute. So yeah, I'm all about this one. Let's keep going. We're getting close. I do see that there's actually one dress. Should we try on the dress? Let's try on the dress. Let's put some clothes on. Put some clothes on, lady. Well, it's official. I have to go to Hawaii now because this dress is just too fabulous to not wear to Hawaii. So book me that ticket. Let's go, babes. Um, here is this adorable dress. Oh my God. I feel like when I first put it on, I was like, oh no, it's way too long. It's not going to fit me. But then I realized that it has fabulous adjustable straps. So I actually think the length is quite perfect. Um, it's like just right above the ankles um, and it's just a perfect summer, easy breezy dress. Again, it's not summer but now, but listen, I have come to learn over the years that if you find a dress, even if it's like not the season or you don't have the occasion quite yet, if it fits you like a glove, grab it because when you are in need of a dress, especially formal dresses, I notice like when I really need something for an event, I can't find it. So if you find something when you're not looking, hold on to it. And this is just one of those things. This also reminds me of, um, I've talked about Billabong and Roxy on my channel a lot and how much I really like them. This reminds me of all of their stuff. Like the pattern reminds me of it, the fit, the feel, the whole thing. I love this. This is effortless, easy, breezy. It has this tie front that I tied like this, but I'm sure you can do it in a knot or any which way you want. My allergies are so bad. I feel like I can't breathe, sorry. I didn't mention this before, but their like new line is the Island Sun Upgraded Vacay Collection, which is everything I'm trying on here. And like, I didn't even read that before, um, but I felt it in my bones when I put this on. I do feel like this is an upgraded vacay collection dress, so spot on, Cupshe, spot on. All right, this is the Brianna Floral Cutout Tie Dress, uh, and it was $36, and mine came in a small. I could maybe get it in an extra small, but I actually think that this is appropriate size-wise. Um, it's got a nice zip down the back and a tie in the front. Yeah, it's great. I guess I could in theory shorten it, but I kind of love it this length and that is definitely rare. I've talked about this with Cupshe uh, before about some of the altering that I did and I did in fact uh, get this yellow dress from them shortened so I'm excited to wear that but then there was another dress this purple one that I decided to keep the length of. Um, so you can kind of play around with that if you're short like me but I do think uh, this dress in particular is perfect to keep the length it is, so I don't have to do anything to it. I love that for me. All right, we got a few more bathing suits. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Talking to myself. I felt like a giant hat was appropriate for this particular bathing suit. A bathing suit that rides very high up uh, and shows off a lot of hippage. 
Uh, again, not my favorite thing to show off, but here we are. I'm here to try it all on and be brave and support confidence and all of you. Um, I feel a rather Kardashian-like in that this is riding so very high. Eh. All right, I'm personally not comfortable. <laughs> uh. Can you tell? Um, but the bathing suit is wonderful. I vacillate between figuring out again where to ride this puppy. I had to decide between um, doing these straps, which they really have improved the straps. I really, really like these new um, clamps on the straps. But I had to decide if I either wanted to hike it high so as to lift my ladies and sort of fit properly up here or if I wanted to pull this down and, uh, you know, let this hang a little bit more. So this one I'm feeling like isn't um, my favorite, but I do really like elements of this. And I do think for different body types, this would work better. This is a ribbing, um, like a very nice ribbed material. And I do have a bathing suit from them in a similar uh, cut. It's in black, so I feel like maybe that uh, just looks different on me and I've been wearing that one. But let me give you the information about this one. All right, this is the Carson Rib Cutout One Piece Swimsuit. Love the color. Um, yeah, she looks fabulous in this and she is wearing this up high. Yeah, this is $32.99 and I understand why it's made very well. I mean, all of their stuff's made well, but like this material in particular is a thicker material, which I like. I got this in a small, um, yeah. I mean, listen, it's definitely sexy. It's just, uh, you know, you try doing this on camera. Uh, 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 okay, well, I mean, I feel like it probably looks cute when I do this. <laughs> I'm gonna change now. This color though. Okay, this is a lot more in my comfort zone. Um, although, this is definitely a different like cut and style than I'm used to. But here is my totally like 80s retro looking cool swimsuit. I like this. It's weird and I like it. Um, let me read about it. All right, this is the Gracie Contrast Color One Shoulder Bikini Top. And then the Gracie Contrast Color Mid Waisted Bikini Bottom. So it is not a set my friends, but this top is $17 and the bottom is $11. So you can mix and match if you want, which is why they sell it separate, but here it is. I, this is really, really fun. Uh, I feel like I want to go like play tennis on the beach or uh, volleyball on the beach. I don't play volleyball or tennis, but this is just, like fun and funky and weird and different. I really like the color. This is fun. I feel like even though it is only one strap, it feels like super supportive. Um, I'm looking at myself and I'm feeling self-conscious, not because of the bathing suit, but simply because I, uh, it's November and I'm starting to, you know, hibernate for the winter. So, uh, but I will say that their bathing suits are so nice and there's such a variety of different styles and stuff. So I definitely, um, you know, if I'm going to have to wear a bathing suit on camera, I'm definitely um, going to be wearing these. I feel good in them. I also have enough bathing suits to last me a lifetime. Um, but I feel like I could do a turn in this. It's not super revealing. Here's my tushy. Um, yeah, this is just so fun and different. I feel like this would be such a fun like pool party uh, bathing suit to wear. Like, I don't know. Maybe I should throw a retro pool party and now I just need a pool. I have all the bathing suits, just need a pool now. This is fun, I really like this one. Okay, one more to go. It's a one piece, so hallelujah to that. Uh, let's do it. And just when I thought the one piece would be less revealing, I put this one on, but I must say, this is one of the sexiest bathing suits I've ever put on. Um, hubba, hubba. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, I feel like I'm in a little black dress. Yes, I cannot turn around on this one because this is like full tushy out. Um, but I'm not mad about it. I definitely love the tie on this. And I feel like with the black bathing suit, like you can kind of get away with doing something a little bit more sexy because it's like just a little understated in terms of, you know, it's not like bright pink and you're like, va va boom. It's just like black, classy. I'll show you the back. Um, besides my tush part, it's just really, really nice. And if I didn't already say it a million times, the quality is 
Oh uh, yeah, this has to be it. Uh, the model is so very cute. Why isn't her butt all the way out? Um, this is the Brienne tie front plunging one piece swimsuit, $27.99. I got it in a small and uh, it is awesome. Hey Jeff, look at this one. I think this is maybe the sexiest one I own. Ew. That's a lot, huh? I'll show you. I can't show them on camera, but look at my butt. Yeah. Yes. Corny, look. Corny, look. Your mama's just t bearing it all on camera. This is like OF uh, style. Well, I have nothing else more to say about this bathing suit other than hubba hubba. Um, am I allowed to say hubba hubba to myself? Of course you are, if you're an old ass bitch from the 80s. <laughs> I feel like this whole thing has been like an 80s. Like, Aichi Mama. Aichi Mama. Ohuga. Ohuga. Um, no, this is, I, Jeff, um, I was saying before that now that I have all this stuff, like we have to go on a vacation. There's just like no ifs, and or buts. Yeah, about it. I wasn't feeling it before, but now <laughs> that you've done a try on video, it's time to go. Uh, we're going to Hawaii, baby. Aloha. Um, let's do that today. Let's book that today. Anyways. This was so much fun. I hope that you guys had a great time and thank you for just being so lovely and supportive of me even in my times of insecurities. I'm looking back because I do know that there is a discount code. Oh, there's up to 50% off sale right now. That's the Black Friday sale. Um, and I know that you'll have a promo code. So I shall leave all the information below as one does. Do you like just like after like 12 years of doing this, I just like straight up just read it off my phone. What are you gonna do? I wanna get the information right, you know? I'm standing here half naked. I can't really offer much more than that. I love you guys so much. Make sure you follow me on Instagram so that you don't miss any polls or voting um, type things, which I've been doing a lot of over there. And um, make sure you hit that notification bell because my schedule is about to get really random and I'm going to try to post as much as humanly possible for Vlogmas. So let's do this. Love you guys, bye.